Hi, this is Dogren. Welcome back to the fifth night. <laughs> the fifth night. <laughs> yeah, the fifth day. It's been that kind of, <coughs> excuse me, night for me. Uh, this is the early a.m. and I got to bed at the uh, early, early a.m. and didn't get a whole lot of sleep. So um, I was still kind of excited to uh, launch, this one, launch this episode, so I figured I'd just go ahead and start it. Anyhow, let's get going here. Any oh, this is different. I think something's changed. Yeah, it has. Um, I off camera went through the town, and it, I most of the buildings are simply placeholders. There's very little loot there. What the, what loot there was, I went in and picked. But, I'll just show you some stuff here before we go any further. Here's the erstwhile landing pad for the pods. With the, uh, my darlings being as inaccurate as they are, I had to keep getting, making it bigger and bigger and bigger. Um, and this is going back to the, uh, the town. I went uh, AFK for a little bit, so I built myself a little bit of flying robot safety right there. This was the previous pad, elevated pad, and this one worked pretty good. I think apparently it was large enough for the... And this is the stairwell that I wanted to do for that building, which I will do for the next building that I come up on. And here's our old digs. They're still here. Um, I'll show you what I've done so you're not left in the lurch whoa see I've fallen and uh, can't get up let's try that again dang gravity just won't cooperate sometimes This is horrid, I know, but I couldn't get it to go much better. There's some glitchiness when you try to add a uh, flat surface to the top of a stair that I haven't quite worked out. I think it's, you know, probably mostly on my fault. I mean, my part, but just not quite there. Anyhow, this is as far as we got. Uh, I mean, at least, you know, you know rooftop. Um, I went ahead and went down there on foot. And uh, I found some good stuff, and uh, I have them right here. Actually, my bestest stuff is... <laughs> oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, baby. I'm really happy to get that. Plus, I got, uh, I got more semi-automatic rifle magazines I got one more of these uh, grenade launcher gizmos and I got one more of these uh, standard MGT high capacity magazines a couple more uh, s the uh, capacitors and the uh, portable reactors and I don't think I got anything new except this wonderful uh, long shot semi-automatic rifle no, that's it. That's pretty much it. But let's let's give a shot here and uh, Well, actually I'm going to go up over here. Uh, I'll go ahead and uh, check the bottom layer of this building right here. What the? <laughs> oh, that must have been one of those deliveries uh, that, that didn't quite get here in a correct manner. Okay. 
Okay. Got the axe. Well, actually. Yeah, okay. And do 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 do. Oh my gosh, another one of those. That's freaking awesome. And that. My, my, my. Yes, that is worth a save. Oh, yeah. And you have to go off on both sides because there, uh, there are areas like here that are only on one, each side. Okay, and there's one other place we got to go. Sometimes there's stuff here. Nope. So this is basically a whole lot of nada. There's uh, there's one place in here. Ooh. Lights out for you, buddies. And that's pretty much what I'm coming up on. And none of the wall, none of the walls work. Yeah, well, actually, the walls work for just fine. None of the doors work. Um, which is unfortunate, but like I said, these are most likely placeholders, and I'm not going to give up this uh, my digs here. It's you know it's a nice safe place I can fall back to if I have to. Uh, but when as the versions go up, then um, more and more I'll be able to check out some new buildings and stuff like that. I'm going to take that and then drop two. There, I run on four now. I put all my uh, put all my uh, bleh, experience points or the, my points in the uh, sink. I just I was just having a, such a hard time uh, keeping my KJ's up with a small amount of uh, a small amount of portable reactors I added another two and then I added the sink power so anyhow we're gonna head out let's see what I have I wanted to go light um, I need six iron and that's for a darn good reason I'll show you in a second can't remember which one irons in ah one two three four five and then to grow on okay um, I found another circuit actually I found two more circuits so I have enough for a turret and I'm on my way to um, uh, let's see actually did I use that I may have used it let me check there were some other things no yeah I did okay so there's only four circuits I used uh, one circuit for a, a uh, charger so I have enough to make a, uh, a turret um, by res researching it and trying it. I found out that uh, the turrets are sit and forget. Uh, you set them and then forget all about moving them because you ain't going to be able to do it. So I've been trying to figure out exactly where I would want to put it. Oh, geez, they broke it. <laughs> when they dropped the pod, it broke the the poach I mean the uh, the landing so as you can probably figure out the next thing I want to do is go to the tower um, I thought that uh, I would take your advice and build a sky bridge uh, because you just expend way too much energy and resources uh, traveling across the land so I just kept at it off screen, offline, bleh, off camera, and we got ourselves a, a skyway to the highway, which isn't looking too good. There's a see if you can see it from here. There's a hive somewhere in there, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to save, and then I'm going to go try to turn the hive. 
because if you can turn a turn a hive, you you've got a got a good little fighting team on your hand. I mean, for you. So you'll excuse me if I bumble around a little bit. I'm working on about yeah 45 minutes of sleep. I'm on call for work, and I got calls all throughout the night. Little piddly stuff, but had to be handled. So got to bed late and got woke up a lot. So I was thinking that having the uh, turret like somewhere in here might not be a bad idea. Um because it would protect my approach to that but and I could put it at the uh, turn here but I don't know that I'm gonna be having all that much traffic along here so it would probably be a waste look at that fence all the way around it now that I can see it but I was thinking I checked all these cars. You can't get into the cars, but I'll try again. Just see if there's a... Nope. Whoa. Is that what I think it is? Oh, it's just... <laughs> just a weed. I thought it was one of those... Uh, one of those ba bombs Okay, now, somewhere close in here is the hive. Whoa! Don't do that. There it is. Right over there. Oh, don't tell me they're coming after me. You know, I think they might be. I was way close before they came after me last time. Let's, let's take a little rest here and Oh. Oh, it's an open. There's no fence. Okay. What I want to try to do is turn them. I really do. And I'm not quite sure how close I can get. I was pretty close last time before they started getting crazy. That may not be true for something that's... Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Those things are murder. Um, guess I'm just going to have to run by him. Ooh, I wish you wouldn't do that. Oh, what is this lag? Oh, it's probably the hive. Now, they were talking about having lag around the hive, and they were right. Oh my god. Yeah, this is unplayable. I can't do much with this. I guess I just have to get far enough away where it's not a problem. Yeah, I'm not going to be doing that anytime soon. In fact, they were probably taking out a, a uh, killer bot, actually. I'm not real excited about going through the town. I think all I'm going to do is buy myself some trouble. What's that? Hmm. So...
Okay, here we go. Wow, it's so big that it feels like you're running slow. And it's very radioactive. <laughs> 